Okay. So you came to this site looking for answers for your hot red ear. Unfortunately, hot red ear is not really that common of a condition for doctors or hospitals or even specialists to try to figure out exactly what it is. There are two types of hot red ear as far as we know. The first one is usually caused by a vascular condition. The entire ear becomes red, hot to touch, and can be caused by just rubbing it, um, allergies, and many other types of um, triggers that can cause this disease to actually have the ear become red. The second option of hot red ear of why you might be getting this condition is caused by an autoimmune disorder. An autoimmune disorder means that the body can actually be attacking the good cells in the body. This usually happens after chronic disease or diseases that have been in the body for a long time. I, you know, sometimes the immune system can get confused. And this, is, this will cause two-thirds of the ear to get red, everything but the earlobe. Now, if you look at the information that we have on this hot red ear section, you will notice the difference in the pictures. Now, to get rid of this, it can take two, at the most, three months. Normally, people can get rid of this in two months if you follow the instructions. To speed up the process, you can buy olive leaf extract or oregano oil. These will help get rid of inflammation. Inflammation is one of the causes and is a wide variety of things that actually can cause inflammation and what make up inflammation, which is different types of disease, um, you know, infection. I mean, these are things that the body is using to try to basically stay alive and fight off these types of infections. That's what inflammation is. Majority of America or around the world has inflammation unless you eat properly then you more than likely probably do not have inf inflammation. So the best thing to do if you want to speed up this process, follow the diet to the T, take raw vegetables, raw juices, and you know blend those for less than 20 seconds. Drink those three, four, if you can do it five times a day. Um, you know, Incorporate some chia and hemp seeds. Those are excellent for omega, uh, omega three, your omega-3 ratio and um, will help kind of keep that balance. Um, omega ratios are way out of balance um, in the world today, mainly due to processed foods, fast food, restaurants. I mean, these foods are full of toxic chemicals that are causing these types of conditions. So it's up to you to get rid of this. You are the only one that can make this happen. So the best thing to do is, if you want to speed up this process, number one, get some olive leaf or uh, pure oregano oil which if you click on the links below you can get that in, in its purest and highest quality and be able to start getting rid of this condition um, immediately now those alone will not get rid of this condition you do need to eat properly this is about ninety percent of getting rid of this condition if you do not eat properly it will not go away and you will continue to have this and if you do have the second one which is an autoimmune disease it can start attacking areas like the heart the lungs and people in the nineties were given about ten years to live because that's what was happening to people with this particular disease so take the steps order these products and start doing the diet and get rid of this condition and you will thank yourself.